a good evening and welcome back to my channel if you're new here thank you so much for stopping by and don't forget to be a part of my family by liking and subscribing to this channel and also turn on the notification bell so that you are notified whenever i do upload a new video my name is Ada by the way and you're welcome to my channel if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back and don't forget to also like this video and share with your friends now today in this video i'm going to share with you guys the best sunscreen that you can use as a black person with an oily skin now okay. it's summertime and most of us always struggle with finding the best sunscreen and i tell you guys i kid you not i have been in that shoe until this moment recently i discovered a very nice sunscreen that i feel can work very well perfectly well for a black person that also has an oily skin now if you're a black person you know that we always struggle when it comes to sunscreens we always struggle with um finding the sunscreen that doesn't give us that um ashy cast and those whitish to begin with we are brown skinned we are black skinned so anything ashy on our skin doesn't look nice at all it doesn't look cute at all so finding a sunscreen as a black person is very hard because of the whole ashiness and the whitish thing that um, most sunscreen tend to leave on people's skin however also finding a good sunscreen if you're black and at the same time have oily skin is even even way way harder because if you find out that most sunscreens out there they're very homogeneous you use them on your face they're very oily they overwhelm your face they clog your pores you end up um, breaking out you know all of that bullshit like no one wants that for summer like we, want, we, we just want to be glowing in summer we just want to be out there living our best life in summer you know so recently I discovered this sunscreen that has really really changed my life I'm actually wearing a sunscreen right now I have no makeup whatsoever on my face Face right now and just look at the glow just look at the glow like look at me look at the glow of my skin like there is no ashiness some some, some sunscreens when you apply them on your face it automatically darkens you like it makes your face look maybe one shade darker than your actual skin but look at the sunscreen like this is my natural face color and it really blends in with my natural self you know it, um it, it, it's so good to find a sunscreen that does like that we cannot always put on makeup because we're trying to cover up the whole ashiness that the sunscreen gives to us like we're not about our life in 2020 we're not about our life anyway guys so i discovered this sunscreen and i've come here to give you guys and tell you guys i'm not going to bore you guys with the nitty gritties of my research and finding this sunscreen i'm just going to go ahead and tell you guys what sunscreen it is where to find the, that sunscreen especially if you're living here in china and um, if you're living outside of the country i'm also going to tell you maybe how you can also get your hands on this sunscreen if you're ready let me see you guys in the next clip so guys the sunscreen i'm talking about is this sunscreen i don't know if you can see yeah this sunscreen is um the dr jat plus every sunday sun fluid so this sunscreen is actually dust blocking uv protector anti-sun exposure spf 50 plus slash pa plus 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 can someone tell me what is the meaning of pa plus plus like i still don't get it i don't get it i don't get it so let me read um some of the items on the back of this um of this sunscreen i don't tell you guys more about the sunscreen so it says moisturizing sunscreen with cypress liquid to clarify skin and protect it from fine dust um dermatologist tested apply gently prior to sun exposure exposure so this sunscreen is moisturizing one it has cypress liquid to clarify your skin and at the same time it protects it from fine dust which is something that wows me about this product i've been using this product for some time i didn't tell you, I've, I've had this product now for two months yeah two months i've had this product for two months so i wanted to like use this product and actually see how it works before i come on here and tell you guys because i don't like to like just create skincare videos without trying out the things that i'm trying to tell you guys to go on and use you know right so um i tried it out and it actually does everything it says you know most sunscreens when you wear most sunscreens the most sunscreens they tend to attract dust to you your face feels um a bit like uh like you have vaseline on top of your face especially when you now apply makeup on top of it like it's like your makeup does not last with sunscreen and um this sunscreen does not do it and again it, it, it doesn't dry you out do i look dried out to you and mind you i'm not wearing much i'm not wearing moisturized under this so number one it, 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 it it's moisturizing at the same time it is not oily two it is dust blocking it does not attract stupid fine dust to your face like it's like it even protects your pores from getting and picking up those dots those dust and again it's 
it doesn't dull the skin it doesn't leave any white cast it absorbs really 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 quickly if you want to see how fast this thing absorbs click on the link to this video up here to see how i apply this product on my face and you will see how fast this thing absorbs into the skin and the skin just looks flawless so now when you go on their website to purchase this um, sunscreen they have different varieties of this sunscreen they have the green one they have the yellow one they have the pink one I just discovered the pink one today now um, I did a very good job because I can read Chinese so I read the reviews underneath each of this sunscreen before I actually chose this one before I bought this one I actually took, took my time to read the reviews underneath all of the sunscreens that they have on the website and um, most people had a lot of good things to say about this product okay especially people with Chinese people with oily skin and that was my like that was what gave me the confidence the very first confidence to purchase this product now for the other ones the green ones the pink one and the yellow one most of the reviews they say it's good too but what I see most of them are saying when Chinese will say it's um, um, it's Zongjiabai Zongjiabai because Chinese people they are very very particular about looking very white you know so when they talk about Zongjiabai it means that when they apply the sunscreen to their face it's like applying foundation on their face the sunscreen gives their face another color a whitish a more whitish color which is the white cast that we all black people are trying to stay away from okay so um, with the other sunscreens on the website I wouldn't say much about you know they all say it's good and most of them talk about how it's you know makes them even more fairer than they are which is something that we don't want to we don't want to hear. so I don't really know about um, its protection and the rest of it so but what I already found out is that these other sunscreens tend to leave a white cast on people's faces which for some Chinese people is very good because it makes them more whiter and they are very happy with that for us black people we don't want that so if you're a black person and you want to purchase sunscreen on the Dr. Jat website please and please stick with the blue one the blue one everyone has a very good thing to say about the blue one the blue one is the best one especially if you're a black person if you're black if you're a white person you can go ahead and purchase, and purchase the other ones because maybe you want to look whiter but for this for if you're a black person and you're trying to purchase please stick with the blue one and another thing is that when you go to the website all of them their name is just every Sunday every Sunday however they do have um, some 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 of them has uh, the, like the pink one is say tone up the second one the the green one says mild sun so they have like a very few differentiation differentiation on them but the, the name that you always see in front of them is every Sunday so don't be confused when you go to the website to purchase purchase the blue one especially if you're a black person okay if you're a black person you're trying to purchase a very good sunscreen for yourself this summer this is the one you should go for question is where do you find your sunscreen now um, if you're living here in China the thing is if you're a foreigner and you're living here in China um, the chances of you buying it directly with your own Taobao account because your Taobao account is registered as a foreigner's Taobao account with your foreign passports and everything so it might not really allow you to buy with your own Taobao account so what you need to do is you need to find a Chinese person a Chinese friend or whoever that has a Chinese account to actually purchase this product because they send it directly from Korea so this product is a Dr. Jat's product which is a Korean brand so they send this product direct it comes uh, directly from Korea and then they send it to you so but you cannot purchase it if you have a foreign Taobao account so if you have a foreign Taobao account then they're not gonna allow you to purchase this product over Taobao so what you need to do is find your Chinese friend and ask your Chinese friend to help you purchase this product now if you're living in the USA I do know that there are so many shops where you can walk in and purchase Dr. Jack's product so you can just you know go ahead go to the beauty shops and purchase the blue one I make the stress on the blue one don't say I don't want to purchase the other one I say let me send you the blue one you can go to the shops and purchase now if you're living in other places and you can find um dr jack's product on there i'm going to uh, suggest a website to you but it's going to be a bit tricky what you're going to do to <laughs> purchase it on this website so do you know the asian beauty website so there's this uh, uh website that really um, caters to um korean brands so they have a lot of korean products on this website but they mostly cater to wholesalers however they do not have um, a limit to the number of products you can purchase on the uh, uh, to the number of they, they do not have a, mi a minimum 
that you can purchase. You can purchase one product, two products. However, they do have a minimum amount you can spend on the website. The minimum amount you can spend on the website is $250. So I think if you really want to purchase <laughs> this product, you should also have other products that you want to purchase from Dr. Jat or from any other Korean brand on the website, and you should be willing to spend up to $250. However, they didn't say um, if you're going to purchase this product, you must have like five of it or 10 of it. So if you're that person that you're trying to find um, Korean products to use, you can go to that Asian beauty website and purchase this product. Now, if you're living here in China, again, this product is a little bit on the high side. It's a bit expensive. It's not, it's expensive. I got this product for 200 and 267 RMB or so. I think it's, it's, it's cheaper now. But you can check check it out. When I do when I purchase the product, this product I purchase for two hundred and sixty seven. But for what it does for me, I feel like it's worth it. Am I going to purchase it again? Definitely, I'm going to buy 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 until they decide to discontinue. I hope they don't. I hope they don't because like right now I don't have any other option of a, a good sunscreen that really works for me. So I hope they don't discontinue this product. So um, it's expensive, but for me I feel like it's really really worth it. And if, you, if you've been struggling like myself to get the right sunscreen, let me show you guys all the sunscreens that I have over the years for. This is one of the sunscreens that I purchased before. I really hate this product. I hate purchased before now this sunscreen is very very good however the only problem I have with this sunscreen is the white cast now I'm going to do a test to show you how fast this sunscreen applies when you compare to this one now this is this is cleave this is cleave I think cleave is a Japanese product I'm not sure but I bought it in China so this is cleave I apply cleave here and I'm going to apply the um, Dr. Jat on the side of my hand okay so for posterity's sake, I apply here. So these are the two products. So two products here, I have Cleave, and here I have Dr. Jat. Now, first of all, let's try and blend in um, Cleave. This is Cleave, you see? You see the white? You see the white cast, the Cleave leaves? Like you need to keep blending and blending and blending and blending to actually get this white cast to actually blend into your skin and when it does happen it's it's like dulls your skin it just dulls down your skin like you don't want to you, you don't want to go out there just with your skin anymore you know you you, you want to uh, apply foundation you know to like you know improve your skin color so this is this is this is cleave you see that ashiness now let's also blend um dr jats here now this is dr jats You see? So blending time, Dr. Jat is almost into my skin and this is Cleave. Cleave is there. And this is Dr. Jat. Cleave. Dr. Jat. Cleave. Dr. Jat. So um, you guys have seen what I mean. So but if I want Cleave to go into my skin, I need to like blend really, really hard to actually get this thing to like you know get into my skin so guys i hope this video has helped you out there if you're out there still trying to find the best um, sunscreen for you then these are the products that you should be looking out for okay look for dr jack's the blues um, everyday sunday sunscreen and you will thank me later if you do get to try out this product please don't forget to come back on this channel and you know tell me what your thoughts are what your experience is with that product anyway guys i'm going to stop here for today and if you have enjoyed don't forget to be a part of my family by subscribing to my channel don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you are notified whenever i do upload a new video and also don't forget to like this video and share with your friends who might be having issues finding the right on screen Anyway, guys, until next time, be good. Bye. By the way, if you want to know how to apply this sunscreen to your face, the steps that you need to take before you apply the sunscreen, go watch my video that I just linked up above. See you guys in my next one.